First of all, I'm so appreciative to be here. It was the beginning of uh, Bill Ludlum's OEU-4 unit and the transfer into the Nicolay CA-1000, the purchase of an instrument I couldn't even afford, which was the Venus in neuroscience, which later on was an evolution to diapsis. Now we've got objective, non-invasive ways to explore timing across the whole spatial frequency. So timing is everything. It's so powerful. It's what's abnormal in dyslexia. It's what's affected in head injury. This is a little girl that you could not test subjectively. She was too young to test subjectively. The power of objective assessment. I can tell you where she has a trans-insane system, and we spent all night at dinner talking about how we can reach those kids with Terry Lawton in therapeutics. I think there are ways. I think there are ways to get in infants with dyslexia early and identify it before they have to suffer both the consequences of falling behind and the emotional catastrophic effects of that. The emotional collateral damage of these problems going undiagnosed is huge. VEPs, abnormal delays in dyslexics, autopsies on dyslexics, duh, I will stand strong arguing an insurance company. So I push and entice the transient system as much as I can. Excuse me, timing is everything. I'm into clinical work, the patient that sits in front of me. And you've got to jump on this train of discovery. So I want to thank you for letting me present this, because I was dying to do this.